What's up, y'all? So, drama alert. Will Corey stress Carmen out this pregnancy? Bow Wow versus Spectacular and more. This Messy Monday is only 18 minutes. That is a blessing, okay? Uh, so, we about to get into this video, man. Y'all make sure you grab your snacks, grab your drink, grab your juice. Let's do that. <laughs> Oh, damn. We ain't got the video right now. <laughs> Let's get the video right now. Ah, so much better. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Nick G, the host. And today, I'm back with another reaction video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. You dig what I'm saying? And what the goddamn hell you leak? All right. I already read the title. Let's get into it. Girl, it is so much going on, but I ain't got nothing to do with it. It's a whole lot, a whole lot of going on. It's a whole lot, a lot of going on. It's a whole lot, a whole lot of going on. It's a whole lot, a lot of going on. It's Monday, and you know what that means. If it ain't about me, then I'm a kiki. First on the dock, and then I'ma talk shit. Got my sugar, honey, iced tea. Do you wanna steal now? Period. I said what I said. Now move along, bitch, before you get red. P.O.P. You can't sit for me. Come on, girls, let's get it. Hey creeps and welcome back to Yes shirt. Okay. Messy Monday. As you already know, you can't sit with me unless you are P. Don't that shirt look like it say what the goddamn hair? Yeah. Is it just me? <laughs> that shit look like it say what the goddamn hair? Yeah. OP and that is pretty on purpose. How you doing? So before we start, I want you all to take a moment to pat yourself on the back because you made it through another week. Like okay. I always say, it is tough it in is. 2021. You it got is. depression, you got stress, you got fake friends, you got mm. money, yes. you got the pandemic, you, yes. all of it, COVID, yes. everything. Yes. But you are here Talk another whole week. So shout out to you. For I'm trying to tell y'all, let's give it a hand clap. Cause we surviving. Come on, Jesus. All right. Friend, <coughs> I just want to say, please hit that subscribe button if you aren't. Also, give us a thumbs up for the YouTube algorithm. Go in the comments and say, we love Messy Monday, okay? Thank you, thank you, thank you for always being here and supporting me. I love you guys, and I wouldn't ask for a better support team. I'm going to get into this. It's not going to be long. There wasn't a lot of mess, as y'all can see, on all of the social media blogs. <laughs> oh, so I ain't going to hold y'all up. We'll get into this shit that is the sugar honey iced tea because you girls love saying in some shit. First on the docket and the sugar honey iced tea, we have Gideon and Justin Scott. This took me for a little loop because like 13 weeks ago, y'all putting cute eyes and heart faces and all that shit up under each other's posts and y'all went on this cute little date. Had the best birthday ever this year. I oh, know that's uh, TikTok, but no man. She's gorgeous. What is going on? Not the heartbreak and the hurt. The melody is so Jordan go for her Twitter and she put this little subliminal message and it very much said, a man wouldn't know how to treat you right if you gave him a man. I know I shouldn't, but I really can't help for blaming myself for not saving enough love for me. In the end, whatever, I don't care anymore, I'm done. And I'm just like, bitch, not Gideon. But girl, it kind of makes sense. It's always the guys who be like, you know, act like they're just so nice, so sweet, and he made a whole song, Heartbreak Anniversary, like he was just so hurt. Nigga, all along, he was probably one who was doing the bullshit and made it like the girl walked away for no reason. Why did she walk away? Nigga, she walked out your life because she was doing too much. So fans started speculating that she was talking about him even though she didn't say it because of those messages and they just started saying stuff. Child, they went and they look, come to find out she didn't follow him, but he didn't unfollow her just like a nigga. Men always tend to act like they ain't do nothing wrong. They're trying to play like they the victim. So he like, man, I'm still following you, Shawty. What's up? But you know, girls, we get in our feelings, honey. And we say, fuck it, fuck you, block you, and I'm going follow you, honey. And that's what she very much did. I be he cheated, girl. It just give me cheap vibes, girl. It just gives it to me. I mean, he's 
seemed really, really, really sweet. But when something's just so perfect, girl, it gotta have a little glitch in there somewhere. And girl, I let mean, he very much cheat and run. So then she tweets out, people will break you down to your last bone and then ask you why you can't set up on your own. Hmm. I'm like, bitch, that sounds like a lyric, girl. Is okay. she like a new song or is this something from his song? They promoting it on the low, don't want us to know. You see, now they got me rhyming and shit. But anyway, I really don't give a fuck right now. I should have stopped a long time ago. So that means he been doing this. So, like, he give us this lovey-dovey, I'm sweet, I've been hurt, oh, please, somebody just come save me and let me be your king. Well, really, bitch, you a whole lot of, whole lot of give me on. you giving a whole lot of heartbreak, that's what you giving, you giving a whole lot of fakeness out here in these streets. Well, really, be giving attention to- Girl, who don't know nothing about this give me on and this situation is me, child. My fault, y'all, because Binks ass sending me a request and I'm doing a video. <laughs> Your girl is skinny on graph. I'm like a vase. I keep cracking but trying to put it back together, but it don't mean I'm fine. I'm still broken. Oh, girl, she is going deep. I really hate who I let myself become, but I know that I want better. And I can't wait for that day. So then, mama, she just keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. And that's how I know something happened because mama is hurt. She done made a whole novel, honey. Like, I mean, I can understand one little fucker I moved on. This is something she been holding in. Mama done wrote a whole essay. Okay, that is giving you. She said cheaters gonna cheat, liars gonna lie, users gonna use. Uh -huh, girl, I don't know. But I told you, I really believe he might have cheated, girl. And she caught that ass for bad. So then she ended off with, trust me, ain't no turning back. Lame ass, broke ass, missed me with that. And I said, oh. Well, he ain't bro. broke. <laughs> Maybe we ain't talking about giving up. Cause I don't think he broke. Girl, he went too broke when you got with him. Girl, he, he ain't broke. He went too broke when you let him smash them cookies, girl. But now all of a sudden, girl, you know, girls get their feeling, girl, they get real hurt. You everything in the book to a man, uh -huh. so. Child, I guess he broke now. <laughs> I don't broke, know. Broke, blood, dick, and some other. Child, so I guess we have to wait for the album to see what she did or what went down in the situation, child. So, I don't know, man. Anyway, if it ain't about me, let's keep keeping this case. Next one, okay? We have Soldier Boy. Now, Soldier Boy has been doing a whole lot of talking, but not enough testing. I don't know why you out here trying to come for the YB fans, but that's not what you're gonna do with us, sweetheart. But let's get into this situation. Soldier Boy went on his Twitter one morning. I guess he was feeling real froggy. It might have been real high. I don't know the case may be, but you know, it was something. <laughs> and he tweeted out, I feel like I'm Soldier Boy in 2006. I said, okay. <laughs> Who asked? And then he retweeted, y'all weird as fuck, all on posts coming in YB. Y'all lame as fuck. Uh, first of all, <laughs> calm down. You don't want us YB folks to come over there and let you have it real bad, okay? Just cause you done came back with a little TikTok song, let's not act brand new. Our man locked up and still hit number one on the billboard, okay? This is our man for me. You out running freely. And, and, and Katie, you know what? <laughs> first so, of all, I don't know why they don't give um, Soldier Boy his respect. Like, Soulja Boy is the reason why we all on this fucking internet right now. Y'all may not understand that, but it's the truth. They used his ass and got us to get on the internet. Period. You know what I'm saying? To get iPhones and all kind of shit. Soulja Boy ain't... He, first of all, he ain't no gangster. He need to retire that. But he is a businessman and he has done a lot. I don't know. I just think everybody need to go in and get that man his flowers. But anyway, um, in the midst of all of that confusion, so some more confusion came out. First of all, first and fucking foremost, I can show y'all the receipts. First of all, soldier can't, soldier can't even get a fucking STD and HIV screening, and I asked him to, and he couldn't. He act, he keep on running around getting the test done. Shut the fuck up. Like I said, he was. Running around the fact of getting a fucking text. Stop playing with me. Y'all swear, bitch, because the best guy only fans or I am here fucking and sucking everybody. No, fuck you, bitch. I'm not no nasty ass bitch, that's for sure. And I never will be. I don't give a fuck what y'all label me as, bitch. I ain't nasty. That's one thing you can't say about me, bitch. They swear they fucking. Yo. Ah! Not the game! Not Binks on the game. Y'all, where? Let me cut this shit off. Close the game. Close the game. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah. 
Don't let me. Y'all don't know the fuck I do with my everyday life. But I be in this house. Oh, if I ain't yeah. fucking no party, event, hosting, I be in this house. Now, I can't get mad for her because. So, I didn't know what the fuck was going on. Oh, oh, no. oh, my God, that was hilarious. Okay, because that's your body, and you only got one body. And when somebody <laughs> mess your body up, then honey, that's all you got. And word on the street is allegedly Soldier Boy had gave something to one of his ex girlfriends. And if that's what that girl is hearing and feeling, then she wants to know, hey, I gotta make sure you good because my business is only fans, and I can't be out here burning these folks. So, child, he ain't going to get the chance. And I feel like if you ain't got nothing and you know you want to smash this cookie, honey, yeah. you need to go out there and get your little test. So, child, obviously he knows something or he feel like she hoeing him. I don't know. But, child. That shit was hilarious. It is what it is. I, I won't fuck him either. I don't care what it did look like. We done seen that OnlyFans. It's nice. Got a little hook to it, but it ain't nothing to get me hooked on. Anyway. Soldier Boy thing look like a C. Okay, I seen it. Y'all, Twitter show everything, okay? I ain't even had to look for it. I think somebody sent it to me or something. But Soldier Boy thing looked like a, like a C. Like, what the fuck? I don't know how y'all dealing with that. With all, you know what I'm saying, everything up in there. But no, ma'am. So then he go over there, he gonna say, what does it take for a nigga to get with sweetie? Bitch, a test. <laughs> test. <laughs> Sweetie, you think Sweetie they gonna lay down with your skeleton looking at? And you over here talking about we done heard on the street that you done burnt somebody and you looking skinny as olive oil, bitch. You got right. with the fuck, Sweetie. It's the skinny as olive oil for me. A test. Maybe he wanted you to go with him, sis. I don't know, but anyway, okay, well whatever. Fuck it, he ain't getting it. Y'all, today is Monday. We live on Tuesday. If it ain't about me. He hiding that his CD. <laughs> Next case. Next one, duck it. We have Cardi B and Jay Younger. Now, unless. One, two, three, four, five. <clears throat> oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Coming out with, I think, her music video or a song, or she was like a. Okay. Next on the docket, we have Darius and Six Star. Now, I don't know if y'all remember, but a while back in October 13, like 2020, Darius had flirted with Sydney Star when she was coming out with, I think, her music video or a song, or she was like a photo shoot. It was something like that. And he was just giving her a appreciation on his <laughs> Instagram, you? like how fine she was, whatever the case may be. Whoop, whoop, whoop. I was like, oh, child, he hitting that cookie back then. I knew what was going on, honey. Y'all a year late, boo -boo. First of all, Tank got his coin. I don't know what the fuck. Uh, so we doing? Y'all, he was ready to smash right then and there, wasn't he? <laughs> y'all, is she a porn star? I mean, no disrespect. It's, uh... What is given? She wasn't. Oh. And it makes sense. I knew um Eddie Winslow like Merle Merkel. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? Let me hug. I ain't gotta do that. I know, I know Carl Winslow in that cruiser clutching that walkie talkie. What the fuck you done got yourself into, Eddie? <laughs> grandma, ooh, Grandma gonna be hurt. Grandma, you know Grandma didn't play that. Mm, it's okay though. She'll be all right. It's 2021. If it ain't about me, let's keep it. Okay. okay. Next one, okay? We have Bow Wow versus Spectacular. Now, child, this 
a whole lot, a whole lot. Of, so spectacular. I went on his Instagram and he posted up this talent show trophy. This is something oh, I got there. Sydney Stars a transgender? Really? Yes. The person I was just looking at? Yes. For the man. Oh, damn. Let me go back. <laughs> I wasn't aware of that part. Oh, damn. Oh, okay. Well, y'all heard what he said. He look like he enjoying all that, but. How am I gonna be? I'm 21. If it ain't about me, y'all versus spectacular. Now, child, this little cat fight was, <laughs> was a whole lot, a whole lot. Of, so spectacular, I went on his Instagram and he posted up this talent show trophy. This is something I got back in T-Ball. I don't know why Battle Wilder got mad over this little plaque. So he got upset because it said that Spectacular was the best performer. And honey, she went ham. She went live and said what she had to say, child. It's my straight up. And I swear to God, Atlanta, y'all are about to witness the greatest show that you've ever seen in your life. I swear to you on that. I'm done being calm. I'm done. I'm not. Four years I've been calm. Nah. G, you host a tour. Yeah. What, you, what you told me tonight? You shit. No, no. You said Green Girls wait no who? Huh? Green Girls wait no who? Wait no you. And now, after you said all that, I was like, Nabal, why when you wake up? <laughs> Don't feel stupid when you off that tour. You know, Omarion Omar, will silence you in a minute. Omarion will silently. Twitter. Bow Wow said that he was not coming to the show, and he said he wants to see how it goes without him in Atlanta. And then that's when Spectacular says, "Simmer down, little Bow Wow." And Bow Wow responded back with, "You've been my opening act for your whole career. Now where the lies, nigga? Chill out. Ain't nobody thinking about you, Magic Mike." Then child Bow Wow went crazy. He done started posting all this shit. I said, oh, this tour just seemed toxic. I Not about why I said he busting cats. <laughs> they doing too much. Spectacular had came back and he responded to Bow Wow's comment about the um Magic Mike and he said, that little feet dance in Harlem Shake ain't gonna save, save you tonight. I hope you bringing somebody out because you gonna need it. And the last time I checked, women love Magic Mike. Nah, Not right, like Mike. Nah. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, they got their own coin too. I don't be understanding why he be. Okay. We're all friends again. Anyway, it was a cute little moment, child. They're gonna have to cook up something else now to keep the girls rolling. Mm -hmm. All right, if it ain't about me, let's keep in this case. Next one, okay? We have Corey and Carmen. Well, child, <laughs> they decided to surprise us with something that I really did not see coming. No time soon. You know, we was gonna talk, we was gonna like, you know, normally we always try our new with y'all, but then we thought about it, like, you know, we just had a miscarriage. And yes, it was like, it was sad because a lot of people, a lot of people was like, oh, they fake, they laughing. They laughed and thought we faked it, which it was actually real, you know what I'm saying? So it was like, we was like, you know, we ain't even go, we ain't even go 10 about this time. We're gonna wait until we, you know what I'm saying, the right time where we know for a fact the baby is healthy, everything's yeah. good. And then that's why we thought that today would be the day to announce it, you know, because now she's like, you wanna, you wanna stand up? I guess I still look Y'all, she gonna stand up and y'all gonna see. Are you guys ready for the reveal? So now y'all can see that this is why we haven't been showing Carmen for real. And this is why I haven't been posting pictures or anything. Gotta turn to the side because you know when you wear black clothes, you can't really see it from the front side. No? That ah! little thing is poking, man. Look at that. Look at that little baby, man. Look at that thing is poking, man. <laughs> So now we went to the doctor yesterday and we was actually able to like this. I was doing my first time seeing the ultrasound. Like the baby was in her stomach. Well, honey, if they happy, I love it. But what y'all needed was counseling and not a baby. 
But hey, well, who am I to tell you two grown folks what to do with exactly. your life? Corbin, what we hope is you don't... Child, let them people have a baby. I'm sick of it. <laughs> like, for real, I'm really, 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 really sick of it. Y'all, let these people have these kids, man. And being they love marriages and whatever. And if, 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 um... Carmen <clears throat> want to keep his ass let her stress her out this time last time she was pregnant you stressed her out sent her through you cheated whatever the case may be woo, 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 woo. what type post come on drama yes back season a baby yes. is not a band-aid what happened let's my teeth but hey if that's what's gonna make you think you're gonna keep your man then girl what's tea? pop out FOMO if you want to Hopefully one of those babies will make him change who he is. I'm just playing. Y'all Y'all know I love Cord. I would have had about 10 babies by him too. Anyway, well, they got the baby coming. So let's see where this goes. We gonna see the stories. We gonna see the, oh, he cheated on me. Or, oh, he stressed me out. We gonna see. We gonna see. Cause you know when a woman get pregnant, they get emotional and Cormac gonna tell it Oh. So we just waiting to see what happens. What Maybe happened? Corey might have turned over a new leaf and he might really become something better and not cheat and not stress her out. Okay. No, mm. I said she missed Jazz Conda. Guide me to the messages or to the whatever. This is really something. No, I said Child, she missed her. Why would she happen. do that? <sighs> well, if it ain't about me, what? let's keep keeping it. Hey. Oh. Y'all, let's bitch. Let's talk about that when we go to our next commercial break. Okay, we about to end this video. Uh, thank y'all so much for tuning in. Make sure y'all follow me on Twitch at Royalties World CEO. I'm live over there all day long. I've been live over there today since 1.30. Okay, it's 200. I be having 300 people over here, 100 people over there. Bring y'all ass to Twitch. Anyway. I'm done with this video, man. I love y'all. Appreciate y'all. We are uh we are on to the next video. Peace.